standard 7 science lesson number 3 properties of natural resources questions and answers fill in the blanks number 1 the capacity of air to hold moisture depends upon the humidity of the air number 2 water does not have a shape but has definite density and mass number 3 while freezing the density of water is lowered. Number 4. Neutral soil has pH 7. State whether the following statements are true or false. Number 1. Sandy soil has low capacity for holding water. True. Number 2. Sea water is a bad conductor of electricity. False. The correct statement is sea water is a good conductor of electricity. Number 3. The substance in which a solute dissolves is called a solvent. True. Number 4. The pressure exerted by air is called atmospheric pressure. True. With whom should I pair up? Group A and Group B. Group A are the questions. Group B are the answers. Air, scattering of light. Water, excretion soil plasticity what will happen if number one the amount of water vapor in the air increases answer when the amount of water vapor increases in the air the humidity rises the air becomes humid number two only one crop is grown repeatedly in the soil answer if same crop is grown again and again, its texture disturbs and the fertility is lowered. The soil does not support the cultivation and the crops will not give proper yield. Yield means production of crops. Answer the questions. Number 1. How is light scattered by the air? Answer. Point number 1. Air consists of a mixture of very fine particles of some gases, dust, smoke and moisture. Number 2 Point number 2 When the light falls on the minute particles present in the air, these particles spread the light in all the directions. Number 3 This is called scattering of the light. Question number 2 what is the importance of air in transmission of sound? Answer. Point number one. Air is the medium for the transmission of the sound. Point number two. We are able to perceive the sound due to the air around us. Point number three. The sound waves travel through the medium of air and reach us. Point number four. In absence of sound, we cannot hear the sound. Full stop. Hence, air is the most important for the transmission of the sound. Why should a glass bottle completely filled with water never be kept in a freezer? Answer. Point number one. Due to an anomalous be expansion of water, it expands while getting frozen. Number two. Point number two, when the temperature goes below 4 degrees Celsius, the density of water start decreasing and at the same time, the volume increases. Point number three, the temperature in freezer is always less than 4 degrees Celsius. This causes expansion of the water. Due to expansion, the bottle MAY may burst. Point number 4. Bottle is made up of glass. The broken glass pieces may cause harm. Therefore, the glass bottles should not be kept in the freezer after completely filling them. Explain the various properties of water. Answer. Water has the following properties. Number 1. Fluidity. Water has a property of fluidity due to which it can flow. 
water is there for used for transport and for generation of electricity water is there f o r e for used for transport and for generation of electricity point number 2 coolant it can cool the heated equipments point number 3 universal solvent almost all the things dissolve in water and hence it is called the universal solvent point number 4 ability to perform body functions water takes part in the different biochemical reactions taking place in the body point number 5 cleaning abilities water can clean almost everything thus is used in our day to day life why is the density of sea water more than that of rain water answer there are many dissolved solids in the sea water therefore the density of sea water is more than the rain water question what is the importance of good soil structure answer point number 1 good soil structure results in good fertility of soil point number 2 when the soil is of good quality the roots get sufficient supply of oxygen point number 3 in such soil the water drainage is good point number 4 the plants grow well in such soil question what are the various uses of soil answer point number 1 plant conservation soil helps plants to grow point number 2 water conservation soil has water holding capacity therefore water is available to us throughout the year point number 3 plasticity plasticity is the property due to which soil can be given any required shape therefore various articles are made from soil they are baked and made hard for longer use example storage earthen pots earthen lamps idols bricks etc question what is the need and importance of soil testing from the point of view of farmers answer point number 1 the farmers want a good produce from his crops point number 2 by testing the soil he understands the constituents of soil in his farm point number 3 color texture and the proportion of organic matter in the soil is tested by various testing procedures point number 4 if there is any deficiency in the soil that is also found out measures to be taken to remove deficiency are also suggested point number 5 the ph and the electrical conductivity tests are particularly useful in understanding the characteristics of soil why is it said that give scientific reasons number 1 air is a homogeneous mixture of various gases answer there are many constituent gases in the air they are in the form of mixture the separate existence of each gas is not felt the individual gases cannot be separated easily therefore the air is said to be the homogeneous mixture point number question number 2 what water is a universal solvent answer many substances easily dissolve in water therefore water is said to be the universal solvent question there is no alternative to water for cleaning purposes answer many substances can dissolve in water therefore for bathing cleaning utensils and washing clothes water becomes very useful solvent it is cheap easily available remedy for cleaning purpose therefore it is said that there is no alternative to water 
for cleaning purpose thank you